broadcast. A lot of bounce on both blue lines here, and we are about set to drop the puck here at center. The Red Wings start with possession as we are now underway. Quick pass across to Gagne. Errant pass, and they can't connect. Takes the feed from the left side. Great defensive effort with the stick. Moves it to Neal. And he takes a shot. Turns it aside with a glove. Grice makes the save there. I imagine he's disappointed that he's trailing in this first period. But he comes off a shutout in his last start. And that's intercepted. Scores! They've been clawing away at this lead, James. Trying to get this game back even. And there's the goal that does it. More than half the period left to play. We are all tied up in this one. New York's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Quick feed to Green. Nice pass. Moves the puck. Blocked in traffic. The Red Wings take it along the wall. And he makes the save. The Islanders will play it in their own end. Here they come on the attack. Barzell's got it in the corner. Taken along the wall by Mayfield. Oh, and that goes awry. Man, they create the scoring chance, and it's a good one, but they don't get it on the net. Takes a shot, and he comes up with it. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Barcel's usually scouted before any key matchup because he's a special player and a good point getter. Larkin's an important piece of this club. They'll be looking for him to produce. I'm expecting one of these two players to be the biggest impact for their team tonight. Back to you guys. Moves the puck into the attacking area. We got a whistle offside the call. Pellick's starting to squeeze the stick a little bit here. He's been a while without a point. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Slides it diagonally to Bertuzzi. Detroit's got it along the wall. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Bertuzzi. Receives the pass. Slides the puck across to Neal. Tried to pick his spot, but that goes off the side of the net. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Sends it over to Larkin. The Red Wings move to the offensive zone. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Neal's going to play it against the half wall. Puts it on net. Whoa. Scores! Right off the pipe and... A good break as that puck can bounce anywhere, but you get the inside part of it, and it goes into the goal. Oh, he tried to flash the leather there. I guess he flashed it. He just didn't catch anything but a cold. The Islanders continue to lead here by one in the first. This is a good start for them. They've got the early goal, and teams love to play from ahead. And now it's grabbed by Dobson. Here's a short pass to Barzell. Cutting to the front of the net. Oh, how did that stay out? What a toe stop on the play. Moves the puck along the half wall. Oh, rocked along the boards. I almost feel the boards rattle where I'm standing here, James. That's a solid hit. There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Stick around. Opening face-off here in this second period is about set to go. Barzell's won it. New York's got a hold of the puck. 
up along the wall by Pellet. Wallstrom's picking up steam. And they won't connect on that one. Huge stop by Grice. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Fabry's played so well in this point streak, you know he wants to pile on it. Lots of time left in this period. New York's been the better looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one goal lead. Puck scooped up by Letty. And now it's over to Raymond. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Keeps hold of the puck. The Red Wings gain control of the puck. The Islanders look to start the transition game. Across the line from center. Here's a shot. Glove save. And that concludes the second period of play. Still one more period of regulation time. We'll see what happens in the third next. Time to drop the puck here in period number three. Larkins won the draw. Letty stick handling in his own zone. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Barzell's gaining momentum. Quick pass to Bailey. Sends a pass over. And now he tries to get it across to Wallstrom. Tremendous play for the team as he blocks it. And that's a great read to force the turnover. The Islanders have done a really good job with their positioning. When they don't have the puck, they've been able to pick off several passes tonight. Who had the edge? Carlin's standing by with the answer. Barcelos played a great game, and I really liked his finishing touch, guys. So based on that, I'm giving him the edge in our matchup tonight. Takes a shot. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Dobson's got it along the boards. And there's a power play opportunity coming up here. Slides it over with pace to Larkin. Into the offensive end now. And the goaltender gets to the bench. They've got the extra attacker out. Let's see the call here. In almost every pregame hit, we talk about how important special teams are. But here we are at the end of the game, and you can see how critical it is. The Red Wings with an all-important power play opportunity here. Pachos won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Puck picked up by Chara. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Puck picked up in the open ice. Angles it over to Beauvillier. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. The Red Wings have it now. Moves it quickly over to Suter. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. New York's got it in their own zone. Trying to clear the puck. Big defensive play on that clear. That puck's got to get out, especially late. He does a nice job here. Hammers a shot. Denies him. He got all of it. And there's the buzzer. 60 minutes have been played, and we are still tied. Let's go to overtime. And we'll do that next here on EA Sports. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. All right, get your sudden death OT pools going. Get your social media predictions. Overtime is underway, people. Grabbed along the board by Pulak. Moves behind the net. Moves it to Pacho. Off target! You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Takes a shot. Pad save. He's on it tonight. Pachot's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Oh, 
to Nyssum with the paddle save. He's sharp on this one. Out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Time's up on the man advantage here in overtime. Sometimes you miss a power play and you shrug your shoulders and go back to bench. This feels like a pretty heavy miss. Can't connect on the pass. The Red Wings gain control of the puck against the wall. Here's a blast! And it's off the iron! These two teams haven't spread out at all today. A tie game is almost broken as that shot hits the post. The Red Wings take possession in the defensive end. Takes the feed. Tries to feed it over to Bailey. And they'll dump it in. The Red Wings have it behind the cage. Feeds the puck across to Larkin. Great defensive effort breaking up the pass. Handles the puck. Love save made by Grice. Detroit's got it against the boards. Slides the puck over. And that goes wide. No, he's got to get that on target. That's a scoring chance, and he doesn't even make a, the goaltender make a save. This one's still up for grabs in the final minute of sudden death. And that's it. Regulation solved nothing. Overtime solves nothing. So we go to the skills competition. The shootout looms here on EA Sports. Welcome back, everybody. These two teams have remained deadlocked after three periods, after overtime, but not for much longer. Time for the shootout. He scores! Goalie got a chunk of it, but not enough to keep it in front of the goal line. If he can snipe one here, he can really put a stranglehold on this shootout. And he buries it for the goal! I really like how he made this look like he was going to deep, but he doesn't. He stays with the shot, and he capitalizes. Piranha set to go here at center ice in round number two. Already down, and he makes it look easy on the play. Just like they do in practice. Stop just what the shooter has to offer. The Islanders needed a shootout, but they skate away with the win. It always feels like a little bit of a coin flip once you get past regulation time. But they come up with the win. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night.